New at 5.30, there is a record number of travelers coming through Orlando International Airport. But while it's good news for the airport, it also means long lines for people going through security. News 6's Clay Lepard shows us how the airport plans to ease those wait times for travelers. Willie Acevedo always likes to wait to make sure his wife gets through airport security. She's a pro at traveling. For the past 16 years that he's lived in Orlando, He's watched the airport grow and grow. Now it is insane. Wait, wait till you see the um, spring break. That's another madness. The airport is already undergoing a $4.2 billion project to handle more travelers and a better experience. But in the meantime, many are noticing longer lines, especially at security. Everybody wants to come here and look at this. This is the downside of coming to Orlando. It doesn't take long to notice the problem. At noon today, there was a line to get into the regular security screening line. At times, that line can back up to the food court. Uh, those like sign most of the passes. Today, members of the Greater Orlando Aviation Authority approved more than $600,000 to go toward two new TSA security lines on the east side of the airport, citing ahead of the spring break rush. This addition is an absolute operational necessity, with time being of the essence. That'll take the east checkpoint now from 16 lanes to 18 screening lanes. So during that peak hour, uh, hopefully our lines are less because now we can process more people. The new lanes are expected to be up and running by the end of the month. At Orlando International Airport, Clay Lepard getting results News 6.